Hi, welcome to interview.com. I'll continue the the previous video which talks about three years, five years, seven years experience codes of interview questions. So I have already uh, talked about 10 interview questions. So I'm going to continue with that remaining 10 questions. Okay. The 11th question will be write a simple Java program for producer consumer problem. They'll say there is a single writer and there are multiple readers. How do you design? Okay, you should you should immediately uh, write a code which has wait and notify notify all these APIs. Okay, so you should know this. The twelfth question will be: Can we catch error runtime exception? Error? Can we catch error? They'll ask you. Yes, you can catch error. You can throw error. The error and runtime exception does not that does not apply to the handle or declare rule you can throw runtime exception and you don't have to handle it even if you handle compile it doesn't bother if you don't handle also it doesn't bother if you handle also it doesn't bother so compile doesn't cry but for other exceptions it cries if you're throwing it you should handle it in the on the collie okay so can we catch error yes you can catch error is java pass by value or pass by reference okay so you this is very very important question you should know for example int x here calc x here okay i'm passing it here x i'm making it 20 what will happen here they'll ask you so the answer will be 10 because you're just copying you're sending a copy of uh, you're sending a just copy of this value you're not sending exact va the uh, exact reference okay so here the value is changed but here it remains same so this shows that java is passed by value and java is not passed by reference the answer will be 10 how many 14th question how many stack frames will be created in the following program display okay here display 1 and display 2 please remember for each for each method a stack frame a new stack frame will be created okay though we are calling from display display 1 and display 2 so for each method call a stack frame will be created to store the local variables to handle the local variables the remaining six questions are here for five years seven years experience code java interview where the static variables instance variables local variables are stored heap or stack you should know where it is stored you have you should be in a position to explain garbage collection explain garbage collection what exactly it does can i enforce the garbage collection okay what is finalized method how it is related to garbage collection so you should be in a position to explain garbage collection 17th what is unreachable object you created a you created object say circle new of circle and set some values and say c is equal to null so so the well the the reference becomes null uh, the object uh, is unreachable okay what are the access modifiers for class and methods you should say public for methods public protected and private okay what is the use of that public it is a it is visible for all the classes outside the package inside the package private within the class it is available protected only for subclasses and within the package okay so you should know the access modifiers for class and and methods what is the difference between abstract class and interface when to use what you should have a proper answer for this question what happens if a super class the 20th question and the last question for this video what happens if a super class does not implement serializable whereas subclass implements serializable what happens so super class um, instance variable will be serialized when i when i when i call serialized when i serialize an object what happens so you should know answer for this question which is, which is a tricky question you know about what what is the serialization but what happens if a superclass does not implement but the subclass implements what I, what happens exactly is for superclass if it does not implement serializable its constructor will be called whenever deserialization happens for subclass which implements serializable proper serialization deserialization will happen okay so you should know this answer hope this video was used hope this video is useful for your interview preparation if you are a three years five years seven years of experience in core java please listen to this video watch this video prepare these questions and be ready to present answer for 
for present day answer for your java interview okay hope this video was useful for more java interview questions log on to interview.com india's top interview guide okay this is a video from india interview.com team all the best for your interview thank you